mean that I'm not a feeble old man who can't button up his own pants. That's what you mean. Can we talk for a minute? Yeah, sure. What's going on? Why are you avoiding me? Avoiding? Well, what are you talking about? Well, I thought we had a good time on our date, but now every time I go into a room, you leave. It's just a coincidence. You walked out of a ball game. There was a woman referee. I could no longer trust the outcome. Spencer. <laughs> All right. Actually, I had a great time, too. You're sweet, and you're fun, you're sexy as hell. I know all this. Cut to the chase. <laughs> the truth is, I haven't, you know, been with anybody else since my wife died. When you kissed me, I, I guess I sort of freaked out. Well, why didn't you tell me that? It's embarrassing. I'm sad about my dead wife. It's not much of a turn-on. It's cute, but I make you nervous. You really do. I was just wondering if maybe we couldn't slow it down a little bit. You mean like hand stuff? <laughs> I mean, like maybe we go out to a movie or just hang out, get to know each other a little better and see where it goes. That'd be nice. I hate that I'm turning myself into your gal pal. Hopefully our periods don't start to sync up. I don't think that's gonna be a problem for either of us. <laughs>